All right, in this video, we are going to install this TH Marine Finger Flex blinker trim onto a 2018 Nitro Z21. Now, this thing is super easy to install, It'll probably take you 10 minutes. So, I'll try to be as detailed as I can going through it. Uh, this is my like first install video, so bear with me. So as you can see, my boat came with the Sea Star Pro hydraulic steering uh, with the tilt. Probably most of y'all's newer boats came with that. Super simple to get the spacer and the shaft off and the steering wheel. It's just six Allen head screws. Pull them off. Once you get the little cap that always decides it wants to fall off. I went ahead and started this. A little easier steering wheel six allen head screws comes right off spacer comes off I already took this nut off this is pressed on so you will need a steering wheel or a gear puller uh, they're on there pretty good but they pop right off it's about one turn all right once you get that off you've already figured out which way you want to put your finger flex on you can either mount the harness cut a hole in here somewhere try to slide it through uh, I decided I'm just gonna go down and uh, zip tie it down that way I don't have to drill any other holes uh, and then I've already got marked two holes there to where I'm going to use two set screws to mount this on there uh, and then okay so here's the blinker uh, you have to figure out if you want to mount it this way or that way on your boat whatever fits better for you uh, I've decided to put it to the right and I'll slide on just like that uh, it does come with stickers uh, if you just don't want to use it for your motor up and down you can also it comes with stickers for your jack plate also so your three wires blue will be for your down green will be for your up and red is your constant hot so I know the newer boats if you look up underneath the console they are all pre-wired already so I found these just pushed up underneath there came right out of the bundle already had the connectors on them uh, so pretty easy all right I got my one set screw in there not going anywhere I'm just decided to run my harness right like this when I hook it up I will zip tie it up up underneath here out of the way no worries uh, and then everything's just reverse order to put your steering wheel back on hook up your three connections hook up your three connections red green and blue up down that easy like I said I'm just gonna zip tie this all up underneath here out of the way put the steering column back on put the steering wheel back on uh, and then in a couple days when I get my new throttle cable I will mount my hot foot hopefully uh, this has helped some of you guys out uh, good luck be safe have fun